Hello and welcome to In The Lab. Now, this is our third and final video from our current group of gardeners. In September, we'll have a new group and they'll make some more videos for you. But before you watch this video, make sure you click on the link above and watch the frog spawn video, where we took some frog spawn and put it into the swales in the garden. So to find out what happened to all that frog spawn, I think it's quite exciting really, do take a look at this video and we'll cover a few more things as well. Right, what have you found on? We found tadpoles! Oh, some tadpoles. We are going to get them back into some water very quickly, but yes, well done. You have found the tadpoles, I love oh. it. I just saw them wriggling. Sam, let's get a tub quick! Quick! Oh, there's the tadpoles now, a lot happier in the water. Oh, we've got an interesting beetle there. Fascinating. Okay, tell me what you found. Found a wood louse. Let's have a good look. Let's get right zoomed in there. He's looking a bit unhappy at the moment, if I'm honest with you. Is he alive? Oh, he is. He's alive. He's I just, think on, I just, he's just on his back there. Nice work, well done. Can you see that one yeah. in the corner? That he's got the beginnings legs. of legs. Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. he has indeed. Oh, yeah. What have we got? What have we got? You need We've to. Got flies. You've got a fly. Oh, how did and you catch a fly? It's eating another fly. Oh, no, it's not. Uh, it's yeah. eating a... Is and it a fly I or got, is it a... Don't know what I got. Let's see. Oh, it's some it's kind of... Oh, hold it still there. It might be a mosquito, possibly, or some yeah, kind of flying. Possibly. It's a flying insect. Is it a bitey one? That's the question. Good work. The yellow fly. It is, isn't it? It's whatever the yellow thing is. The fly has got it, and it's not leaving. Is that how you caught it? Because it was eating. Yes, it. Yeah, it was distracted. Well done. Oh my. Oh. Okay, here's the tadpoles again. We've even got some with legs. Where's one with legs? There's one. Look. There. Can you pick it up, Hannah? That's Go on, it. Connor. Oh yes. Yes, Connor. Sometimes the <laughs> legs are so powerful they jump off your hands as well. What's your jump? Like, jump. Yeah. Oh. Doesn't, doesn't want to jump yet, does it? No. It's, it's still. Oh, oh it did a little jump. Then. Now then, do we remember Fife here? He was the sunflower planter, and look now. Look at the progress after just a few weeks. Well done. Progress. It's going to be huge later. Red spider. Have you? Yeah. Where is it? There. Oh, let's zoom in. Oh. Oh, there it is. Oh, yes, I see what you mean, yeah. Well done, well spotted. Where did you get that from? Um, just in that grass over there. Just in the long grass by the swales. Very good. So what are you doing again? We are breaking the stem so we can break more around the rock. Okay, you're getting rid of that root that's coming in. Someone has. Or whatever it is. Through the rock over the fence, over the fence. and also a wire. So they are, oh. they are vandalising our land. Oh dear. Well, at yeah, least yeah. we're tidying it up and getting it nice and clean. Well done. Yeah. One nil. Fine. Will Greg's up a tick. <laughs> so in the garden today, we have some watering. Sam over there. Some planting with Mrs. B. And at the moment, everyone else is collecting species. So they're running around with nets. They are looking for creatures. Over there, especially by the water. And we've got some very excited tadpole finders here. We've got loads of tadpoles. So let's see what we discover. Just a view of our wildflower garden with the honesty. We've got some nice foxgloves there and some geraniums. There's a big spider we've got. Well done, this is just one scoop off the ground, isn't it? We've been sifting through, what have we found? We've got, what's in there? There's a caterpillar we found yeah, and, and a wood louse. And, and they, the are they chasing each other? And the spider. So. They, they do not like each other by the look of it. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. They're like, get out of my way, get out of my way. Yeah. We found loads of stuff in here. What have we got? This was in the herb bed. Yeah. The leaves are quite clear as to what sort of tree it might be. Okay. Possibly. Hmm. Oak tree. I don't think so. Sycamore. Anyway. Go on. No, there's a big clue. Because look what is attached. Oh my goodness, is it a chestnut it's tree? It's a horse chestnut tree. Oh. And that's its conquer it's grown out of. Nice, I do like that. So someone at some point has dropped a conquer on the ground and we've got oh, a new it tree. Fell in. Yeah. Is it worth us keeping it somewhere, do you think? Should we plant it? Could plant it, yeah, sure. What do we think? Do you want to have a go at planting it, girls? Yeah. Nice. Sienna, it is yours. <laughs> okay, where shall I plant it? Where would you like to put it? How big the horse chestnut trees grow? Massive. Um, Let's have a think about that. Okay. I'll decide. What do we have here, Sam? We have some rhubarb. Oh. Freshly picked and de-leaved. Yes, so I like it. So I can it. now be eaten. 
and we could uh, we could chop this up or we could what stew it heat it up put it with the uh, custard crumble that sort of thing nice little crumble yeah i like it i like it and this came from here did it over here yeah so we've this... left, left some of the stems on the plant so that yeah. then it will grow back nice and hopefully give us some more rhubarb to eat i like this time of year because as you can see everything's growing uh, we are getting some nice strawberries here we get some raspberries further off. Everything's getting taller. All these plants are growing that weren't when we first did our garden video. So this is the beginning of harvest time, isn't it? It is, yes. I like it. One more look at the rhubarb because it's just mm, mm, delicious. Thanks, Sam. Okay, so we haven't actually got any fully grown frogs, but if we zoom in, we can see that the uh, it's got a little face, hasn't it? It's, it's the closest we've got to a frog so far. A little tadpole with legs. Look at that face. It's almost like talking to us, isn't it? So Sam has got the strawberries off our strawberry plant. He's picking everything today. We might try those a little bit later on. Apparently, I've just heard we've got a frog. Where is it? Dom has it. It's not there. Okay, I'll find him later. Now, Sienna over here, we found a nice spot for our conker tree, our chestnut tree. Yeah. Have we started digging yet? No, not yet. We're going to. Nice. This is going to be great. In a few years time, it's going to be massive. Now then, down at the water's edge, Weeks after we put the, put the tadpoles in, there are loads jumping around and walking around on top of. Then, if you can see, they're skipping around and jumping on the top. Tadpoles with legs. There we are. There's a few. They're everywhere. They are the most like frogs that we've ever seen so far. Now, you said you'd found a big frog, didn't you, over here? It weren't big, it was small. A small one? Yeah, but I'd actually wow. found one without a tail, so. Amazing. There's a frog over there. There's quite a few, aren't there, knocking about on the water. Brilliant. Where is he, the one? The frog. We've got one in there. There he is, there's one there. He looks a bit unhappy, but we know he's alive. He keeps moving around. No tail at all. There he goes. Love it. Well done, Dom. Frog man. We've got to release the frog! Okay, so this is the massive collection of the frogs. frogs. You have? Everybody's got frogs today. We've got a frog sitting up on your hand. He seems quite content and happy there. Yeah. So that means he must be able to breathe oxygen by now. He's grown the ability to live in the water and in the air. Like it. Maybe because I've done all this. All right. Well, oh, you have done a lot of this. It's the grand release of the tadpoles and frogs again. Oak. Let's take them back to the swales. Uh, we always release them back where we took them from. Frogs. Back we'll go down to the by the steps. Don't put them. <laughs> I like it. It's a very, it's a very emotional feeling like putting yeah. away my, uh, my poor tadpoles. You're right. <laughs> when you've watched your children grow up and you have to say goodbye, off into the free world. No! Oh, we're heading down. No! Goodbye, frogs! Okay. Off they go, off they go, ready to grow. I hope we come back next time. Don't slip, Dom. I hope we come back next time. Bye bye. Bye, frogs. And they're gone. Well done. We have got strawberries and we have got rhubarb, and it is now time to come and eat the strawberries. Come and enjoy the strawberries. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And we unfortunately won't be back. Football's coming home! It's coming home! It's coming home!